This is the second time shooting the video because the first time I cut off the top part of my head and you couldn't see my face, so... Here we go again! Seeing as there's no theme this week, I'm kind of creating my own thing type deal. I don't actually really know what I'm doing. What I wanted to do today was list a bunch of classical music tracks that I think people should listen to. A lot of it is pretty well-known stuff. I took quite a bit of it from a book called 1001 Classical Music Pieces to Listen To Before You Die. It listed a lot of great stuff, much of which you've probably heard before and even more of which you probably haven't heard of, but you should listen to because it's amazing. This book actually goes from medieval madrigals all the way to the 20th century, which is pretty cool. There's a link to the site I was looking at and it lists all of these recordings as well as the CD that the author thought had the best recording of that particular piece. So you should make an excursion to your local library and just go nuts. It's all listed in chronological order of composition and there's quite a lot so I'm not going to have comments on everything. Here we go! Handel, The Messiah, Bach, The Goldberg Variations, Mozart, Requiem, Haydn, Symphony 101, The Clock, Beethoven, Symphony No. 9, Chopin, The Mazurkas, Mendelssohn, Midsummer Night's Dream, Schubert, Winter Rise, Berlioz, Symphony Fantastique, List, The Hungarian Rhapsodies, Wagner, Die Valka from the Ring, Shostakovich, Symphony No. 5, Orff, Carmina Burana, Tchaikovsky, The 1812 Overture, Rimsky-Korsakov, Scheherazade, Mazorsky, Pictures in an Exhibition, Ravel, Bolero, Brahms, Symphony No. 2, Dvorak, Symphony No. 9, The New World Symphony, Mahler, Symphony No. 2, Strauss, Don Juan, Debussy, Prelude à la Prémédie du Fond, Sibelius, Finlandia, Dukat, The Sorcerer's Apprentice, Albanese, Iberia, Holst, The Planets, Stravinsky, The Rite of Spring, Copeland, Fanfare for the Common Man, Bernstein, West Side Story Suite, Reich, Different Trains. I wanted to stick to stuff that I know and that I actually like listening to, but there's a lot of stuff that didn't make it on this list. Like, really, you should listen to everything by Mozart and Beethoven and Brahms and Bach and Reich and Tchaikovsky and all of those guys and everyone that's on this list and even more. The sad thing about music these days is that there's very, very little that people are exposed to. Listen to any top 40 radio station and you can hear the same song being played within the hour. But open up those doors that extend all the way back to medieval times and you have infinite possibilities of music to listen to. It's all incredibly amazing and exciting. It stretches your ears and your mind as you listen to it and as you try to understand it. Rather than just the pop music of today which has two melodies that they repeat over and over again. I'm sorry, but that's really, really boring. Granted, there are some popular musicians today that are incredible incredibly talented and actually write very good music. But I'm challenging you girls to listen to something new. It could be from this list, it could be from the big grandmaster list, it could even be not even on that list and something else entirely. Seriously, this isn't that hard. You can probably find most of this on YouTube. So have fun enriching your musical lives and I will see you in the world.